There's a setting on the iPhone that we all think is made for privacy. But the truth is that it sends data to advertisers, even if it's anonymous data. And despite that, most people keep it enabled without even noticing. Give me a second and I'll explain it. And to be clear, turning it off is a million times better. There's a setting on the iPhone called Privacy Preserving Ad Measurement inside Safari Advanced. And even though the name sounds premium and reassuring, the idea is a bit different. Apple made this feature to measure ad performance without knowing your identity. In reality, it doesn't send any personal data like your name, IP, or Apple ID, but it does send a small signal to the advertiser telling them that the ad was viewed or clicked. That's called anonymous measurement, not full tracking. Why is this important? Because some people think this is a strong privacy feature, but in reality, it's a commercial balance between privacy and advertising companies, meaning Apple reduces tracking, but didn't stop it 100%. And let me tell you two very important facts. First fact, this feature works after you close the browser, meaning the sending is not instant. So it doesn't affect your performance or battery, but it still remains a small entry point for some data exchange, even if anonymous. Second fact, turning this feature off doesn't affect the ads you see. Because ads mainly come from Google, Meta, and Apple ads themselves, and they don't rely on this setting to work. So turning it off won't break anything and won't reduce or increase ads. And it's also important to know that this setting has nothing to do with real tracking protection, like cross-site tracking, significant locations, or ads personalization. These are the settings that actually make a big difference in privacy, and we can talk about them if you want. So if your goal is the highest level of privacy without complications, then the normal and logical thing is to turn it off. How do you turn it off? Very simple. Go to Settings, Apps, Safari, Advanced. privacy preserving ad measurement and turn it off. And that's it. You're done. If you want even higher privacy on the iPhone, I still have other settings that are more serious than this one. And if you want a full video about them, tell me in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe so you can see the upcoming videos as soon as they drop and leave a comment with your opinion. Your support keeps me going and working on all these details.